Now, despite the Redway Airlines debacle, the Lincoln Airport is moving forward with its leadership. But this mistake was not on David's shoulders. There were a lot of people to be held accountable in the risk that we took with Redway. An elected official had previously asked for the airport's executive director's resignation. Good evening, everyone, and thank you for joining us. Today, the Lincoln Airport Authority Board reflected on its leadership. It took a vote of confidence in favor of the executive director, saying he's not the only one to blame for Redway's failure. Channel 8's Veronica Barreto joins us now live from the airport, where the meeting today took place. Veronica? That's right, it was a unanimous vote to keep David Herring. The board says this is an opportunity to learn, be accountable, and grow the airport for the people of Lincoln and surrounding areas. The vote comes after a Lancaster County commissioner asked for David Herring's resignation following Redway's audit. And we thought rather than just dance around this issue, let's put it on the agenda, bring it out into the open create transparency, let the public talk, let the board talk, uh, and hopefully move on once and for all. The airline received $3 million in American Rescue Plan Act funds. It ceased operations three months after its first flight, leaving many people waiting months for a ticket refunds. Funding for the project was approved by the Lancaster County Board and the Lincoln City Council. Lincoln's in a funky market from a geography standpoint. So it's just a really tough market, so we've got to think creative, think ways to be different and make Lincoln stand apart and, and be separate. And that's kind of what was envisioned March of last year. Before the vote, the public had a chance to talk to the board and everyone spoke in favor of keeping hearing. I want to talk about all the airlines that have come here. Uh, they didn't last. And now we got another one that didn't last. And, uh, but to put that on him, I don't think is right. A Lincoln business owner says he hopes the airport continues to take risks in order to attract more people and make local businesses grow. It's, it's unfortunate that the roadway experiment was um, so short-lived, um, but I think the, the real tragedy out of it is, is if, if that's the last time we ever try something. And I think if we don't try something like that again, um, it would be like never putting the arena downtown, and, and who knows what the skyline would look like now. And the Board of Commissioners say they hope this puts an end to the right way incident and says they will focus now on moving the airport forward. Reporting live in Lincoln, Veronica Barreto, Channel 8 News.